Hey guys, Chris from Cobra Razors. A uh, little instruction on the CR1000. This is how you're going to get your CR1000 depending on what color you get. Um, this is the yellow and then we have the, the black and the clear. You're going to get it just like this. It's going to, uh, you just push open the side, flip it open, um, and then when you empty the contents, just hold your hand underneath of it. Uh, you're going to get a instruction booklet. You're going to get in the back of this your six blade and you're going to get your stand obviously <clears throat> and then you're going to get the razor with a four blade attached to it so when you get this thing if you guys already know that you um, that you like a three blade then just go ahead and use it like it is that's our four blade that's here so if you use like a Mach 3 um, if you already know that you use a Gillette Fusion if you like the the finer blade uh, the, the, the um, more additional blades uh, this is our six blade, which does a really good job. This is my personal favorite. I use the six blade. I use it all the time. Um, so when you get this, it's going to be in this position here. This is for the face position. So there's a little logo on the front of this. You put your index finger on on the uh, the logo, and essentially where your hands feel com your fingers feel comfortable um, for the rest of, the, of it. So just pick it up if you want. Just set it on your desk uh, or your vanity, and just pick it up like a baseball, um, almost like a baseball, I guess. Um, <clears throat> like you're gonna throw a curveball. So this is the face position, and then you just pick it up, finger on the uh, on the on the on the trademark, and just go ahead and shave, just like so on your lip, your chin, uh, you want to just flip it around and do the chin, under the chin, just like so. Now, there's a spring-loaded tab, right there is the spring-loaded tab. This gets pulled back and then you just easily flip the handle up and you'll hear it click. This then locks into place. Now, you slide it under your finger, you can use your middle finger or you can use your um, your ring finger if that's what you want to do I personally use my middle finger first and second knuckle pick it up and just run it across your head now the skid plate here does not touch your head there's no need for it to touch your head um, it is it is it should be sitting on your hand nice and comfortable don't overcomplicate it and don't overthink it so just just hold it just like so um, the, these are your two controllers basically um, some guys rest this finger on the tip of the blade, which is fine. Um, <clears throat> you'll get to use it about using it about two or three times. You'll get a good handle, and you'll be able to shave this thing, um, and you'll won't have any missed spots or anything. So, um, front to back, front to back, front to back, all the way around, around your ears, and then you just want to slide it off, spin it around, and slide it back up on the same finger or whatever feels comfortable for you guys. It's a really easy product to use. And then you want to do the back up to the top. Okay, it should take you about two to three minutes to shave your head. Once you use it two, three, four times, you'll you'll be able to zip right on through it, man. And I do say zip. Um, you'll be able to flip right, you know, go right on through and, and shave your head pretty quickly. So um, that's basically the instruction. If you guys have any additional comments, please send me an email. I will get back to you. Um, but again, real quick, this is the head position. There is the slide tab on the bottom. It's spring-loaded and you flip it open, you hear it click, and this is now locked into place. Just make sure it's locked into place. Um, also for maintenance, make sure you guys clean this thing, like soak it in, in hot water, um, warm water, like once a month, because depending on the shave gels that you guys are using or the barbersaw, whatever you guys are using, it will get some funk um, all up inside, inside around the locking mechanism and all. So if you clean it like once, a month just soak it in some warm water um, if you want to put a little bit of soap in there that's great but that'll at least alleviate all that stuff now if you use our shave gel you don't have to worry about that because our shave gel is all aloe and it cleans up real nice and it goes away with the warm water and it cleans the blade real nice so um, but this is the face position just like so you hold it just like like this and then this is your head position and if you're left or ha right handed left handed it don't matter and then this is for the back, shave in the back, and this is the front, just like so. All right, and if you guys want to use it like this, that's fine too. So that's basically it. Um, if you guys have any additional questions, just send me an email. I tried to keep this thing under five minutes, um, so hopefully uh, I did a good job, and hopefully um, uh, you guys will be able to shave with this thing and and uh, and be happy as I am with it. All right, uh, that's it. See ya.